so I'm in my mini camper van. Um, camped out here outside of Moab. Uh, there's a puppy. Okay, I'm going to show you uh, what I have in my fridge, in my pantry is what I'm calling it. And I just made this stain on there, so I'm going to cover that up. <laughs> um, so, I just got this Joy Tutu's Tutus fridge um, this past winter. Um, I guess I bought it in January, February. Because I just got a solar panel, a 200 watt solar panel, and a power station. Um, and so that's what this is running off of is the solar panel. Basically, I just didn't want to spend a lot of money on the fridge. I thought the power station was what I should spend the most money on. Um, and I didn't want to go like super top of the line with a Dometic fridge. Um, and so I went on the lower end basically because I didn't think it was that big of a deal. Anyway, so this is going to be difficult to hold this open. <laughs> so I've got it really stocked up right now. Um, oh, I did have those Hershey Kisses in there. <laughs> so Sprouts, I got that for my wraps and um, I just put it on my ramen. This bitchin' chipotle sauce, really good. I put that on my wraps. Cucumber for the wrap. I got some bell peppers to dip in the hummus. I could also use that for a wrap. Um, I got these because they were on sale. I normally wouldn't eat this, but I thought it could be like a dessert. And um, I guess, yeah, they were all, like discounted. So I was like, okay, I'll get them. Uh, oh, I got some more chocolate. Um, salad for the, the wraps. Normally I would go for um, like red lettuce or something, but without in the plastic, but they didn't have any lettuce out. <laughs> I got two things of strawberries because they're like popping off right now. And they're so good. Cheese for the wrap. Um, I got baby carrots for dipping into the hummus just because I, I'm trying not to like snack so much with like chips. Um, and then this is my red onion for wraps. And then usually was having a lot more um, sparkling water in here. Seltzers. What do we call these? I just started drinking this stuff. Sparkling water? Okay. I just started drinking this stuff like last fall instead of beer. So try, just try not to drink so much. So um, I usually had a lot more in there. But once I got all these groceries, um, I didn't have room anymore. So I usually only have about two in there. So, all right, I'll put the rest in later, I guess. And then I'll show you what's in my pantry. <laughs> it's what I'm calling my pantry. So I got some bananas. And then this is just something I picked up at a thrift store. Uh, I was going to use for my cash for the Hey Duke, but ended up not needing it. And it was really big anyway. So I use these uh, tortillas for my wraps. I would probably like to use something different, but I haven't been able to find anything other than the tortillas. I also use these for my burritos. Um, I'm obsessed with peanut butter crackers. I usually like the Lance brand from Costco and I buy like them in cases. And I like having those in my car um, as like a snack whenever I'm somewhere. I got this for my ramen. I thought it might be nice to have some crunchy to it. I'm kind of experimenting with the ramen and I'll show that later. I got some apples to go with peanut butter because I'm still got some hiker hunger and peanut butter is everything right now. Granola bars. Um, this is like some athletic greens, some drink mixes, emergency liquid IV. This is kind of left over from my hike. Um, here's some oatmeal that pre-made oatmeal that I made like with instant breakfast and, um, 
peanut butter powder that's left over from my Hey Duke hike. I've got some mixed nuts. I've got, um, and then I've got ramen. So I've got, that's the only kind I had really had before. I like this. And I found it in Safeway last year, but I can't find it anymore. And then some Hey Dukers told me about this brand. And that is what I've been eating. Um, that's what I have right now for my dinner. So it's got the chow mein noodles and the sprouts on that. And I just cold soaked that. I don't even, because I cold soaked on the trail. So I don't even use my jet boil. Um, and then this is what I make burritos with. That's what I make burritos with on the trail in a jet boil. Um, and so that's something easy I can make out here. Cause I, I just have a jet boil. I, you know, I don't have like a, a stove thing. Um, I'm obsessed with anything prickly pear. And, and this is stuff that I got after my hike. Um, I have <laughs> some more prickly pear tea, but this actually has a lot of different kinds of teas in here. Um, which I haven't been um, drinking too much of that because, you know, it's usually hot. And then I have some uh, honey a friend gave me in Flagstaff from their bees. So that is my pantry. This is my kitchen. It's kind of messy right now. I've just got a little um, cloth, a uh, reusable cup. Got my olive oil paper um, clip in there. I use these Talenti jars to cold soak in. Got another cup that I don't really use. And then just some containers, some Ziploc bags, jet boil. It's another stove that I never use and some compostable bags as well. So, and then I just use I just use this like switchblade <laughs> to cut my onion and cucumber. Oh, that's hard to close one-handed. There we go. And then just a normal spoon. So that's my fridge and pantry setup and my minivan.